name is Bobby Guido. I'm third generation farmer. The grape growing year starts uh, in the winter time. We start by pruning the grapes. So it's probably one of the most difficult processes because you have to know what you're doing. I think the biggest thing my dad has taught me is, you know, every year is different. And every year you need to adapt to what mother nature throws at you. If you miss a step, it's gonna affect you all the way down the road. You know, being in, in the BC wine industry, we're all, we're all farming. We all, all, all have a common goal. My name is Gene Covert. My grandfather and grandmother started the farm in 1959. Spring is an exciting time of the year. We'll be checking every morning for tying, thinning, planting cover crops. Being a long-time organic farmer and now regenerative farmer, we are attempting to regenerate the soil health using cover crops and animals to build up our soil. My name is Dakoa Harder. Summertime in the vineyard is super cool because the fruit actually sets. We're seeing it grow. We know what sort of yields we're going to get. So the whole goal is to grow fruit, not the vine. So the vine has a purpose. It feeds the fruit. You want as much of that nutritional value to end up in the fruit as possible. My name is Wes Johnson. Every year there's a different grape and a different wine that sort of develops perfectly for that year. Once we get into harvest, you know, we're just hoping that the weather cooperates. You know, we live at work, but we also just love coming to work and being here. It's the place that really defines the wine. We get a unique sense of self and terroir reflected in the bottle. One of the biggest joys of being in the wine industry is that it enriches people's lives. The British Columbia wine industry is an amazing place to visit. What we produce and put in a glass is something that we can be proud of wherever we take it in the world. <laughs>